Hello everybody! Today we are going to talk about recovering files which get deleted when you empty the recycle bin. We all know that after deleting a file, Windows sends it to the recycle bin, a special folder for deleted files. We will also explore the situation when data gets removed with the keyboard shortcut Shift plus Delete, that is, when the recycle bin is not used and the files are removed irreversibly. However, you should also remember that the recycle bin size is limited and the operating system will empty the bin once it's full. Alright, so you have just removed a folder with important data. You can easily bring it back by pressing the keys Windows plus Z. To be more exact, you can either delete a folder and then use this key shortcut or right-click and select Undo Delete. The folder will be back in a second. If you removed a file sometime before, you can recover it by just opening the recycle bin and clicking Restore. This will send the file back to its original folder. So, this is how you can recover any files that you have deleted accidentally. If you can't find the recycle bin on the desktop of your computer, do the following to add it. Click on the Start menu, choose Settings, open Personalization, click on Themes, find Desktop icon settings, add the recycle bin and click OK. Usually, when you delete a file and then empty the recycle bin, or when you delete something irreversibly with the help of Shift plus Delete shortcut, you may think that this file is gone forever. <laughs> but that's where you are mistaken. In fact, files deleted from the recycle bin can be restored with specialized data recovery software. For illustration, I'll be using Hetman Partition Recovery, and I will give the link in the description. Suppose you have some data on disk D. Delete the files with the help of the key shortcut Shift plus Delete. Now the files are gone, and you can't see them in the recycle bin as well. To recover the deleted files, open Hetman Partition Recovery. The first thing you'll see when it starts is the File Recovery Wizard. Choose the disk where your data used to be. Click Next. When the scan is over, click Finish. The program has found your files. You can use the preview window to see their contents. To recover the files you need, drag them to the recover list. If you don't see it, go to View – Toolbars – Recover List. Specify the saving method. Next, select the folder where to save them and hit Recovery. If you run the scan, but the program failed to discover your files in the folder where they used to be stored and from where they have been deleted to the recycle bin, then try to find them in the special folder with the name recycle.bin. Here is what you do. Start the program. Click on the disk from which the data was deleted. Wait for the analysis to be over, if you haven't scanned this disk yet. Go to the folder Recycle.bin. Check these folders to see if your files are there. To recover the files you need, drag them to the Recover list. Hit the Recovery button. Choose the saving method, click Next and Recovery. Finish. When the process is over, you will find the recovered files in the folder you have chosen. And finally, what should you do if the files were removed a long time ago and it is only now that you have noticed they are missing? It is time to use full analysis, and this is what you do. Open the program, right-click on the disk, choose Analyze again, 
In the window that opens, choose Full Analysis. Select the file system of your disk. To find out what kind of file system your disk has, right-click on the disk inside the program or in Windows and select Properties. The information you need will be displayed in the File System field. So, you choose the proper file system option and click Next. This process takes some time to wait until it is over. In the end, you will see all the files that have been deleted from this disk. And that is all for now. Hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Leave comments to ask questions. Thank you for watching and good luck. While you're watching this video, civilians in Ukraine are dying from attacks and bombardments on the Russian Federation. Putin's insane regime has attacked a peaceful country in the very heart of Europe. Support the Ukrainian army by making a contribution to the fund Come Back Alive. Use the QR code or the link below the video to transfer any amount of money that will boost Ukrainian resistance and help it counter Russia's dishonorable invasion.